knew that was gonna happen. Brooklyn, Brooklyn. I am better than all of you. It's a new day. Yes, it is. What's up, fam? This is KP in DC, and this is Russell Crate's April and March. Cool movie. I've seen it a few times, but I probably won't watch this DVD, but I can appreciate it though. This is probably the coolest item in the box. I love stuff like this. I'll add this to my WrestleMania pin collection. The value of these boxes go up when they include a figure. Mattel's work is top notch. However, I already own a custom of this exact Terry Funk. Let me know which one you think looks the best. The shirts in these Russell Crate boxes have been great. This one is, uh, I don't know. It's made of quality material and it's super soft though. And finally, the April box wouldn't be complete without Rob Van Dam. I was supposed to meet him during WrestleMania 32 weekend and simply ran out of time. I'm high on Russell Crate for including it here though. Okay, that's it for the April box. Russell Crate came through once again with another solid offering. My favorite item was the lapel pin. It's a great keepsake. What was your favorite item? But uh, don't leave yet. Here's Russell Crate's March. First up, the ROH DVD with Kevin Steen facing off against Eddie Edwards and matches with Adam Cole, baby, Jay Lethal, and the Briscoes. Yo, Sid was my favorite growing up. I used to love his entrance. Last month, we got the Kenny Omega shirt. This month, we got his autograph. Pretty dope. And finally, we got a bottle opener, but I don't drink, so I'll probably give this to one of my homies. This box actually included one more item. It was actually a t-shirt that featured um, the Shawn Michael quote, But I kind of cheated and I opened this box before WrestleMania weekend. Here I am wearing a shirt during that weekend in Dallas. I hope you enjoyed this video. Share it with your friends on social media. And uh, until next week, peace.